me if we passive income. Now, there's a trade-off, right? I can either take my money all at once and pay a higher amount of income tax. I have a higher income, right? So I'm paying more money out to you know, the CRA or the IRS. Or I can take a smaller amount now, reduce my taxable income, and then take the rest of it in, as the checks come in. There are no smaller checks that I get $10,000 a year, $8,000 a year for the rest of my life, as long as those clients continue renewing their mortgage. You know, and I know Andrew's in the investment industry, and I don't want to speak for him, but I know in the, in the investment industry, that's one of the industries where you can generate passive income for perpetuity and even go on to your estate, if I'm not incorrect. So those, to me, are real ways of earning passive income. The other thing that a lot of people don't understand is credit card. 